Hi, today we're going to talk about the Yiji Kimyang Ma, which is the Wing Chun stance, and how to get into it correctly for Su Ling Tao, which is otherwise known as the Little Idea and the first form of the Wing Chun system. Okay, so with our feet together, hands by our sides, we're going to bend our knees, toes out, heels out. Okay, so now sitting in our stance, relaxing, okay, our weight should be evenly distributed between both feet 50-50. Our heels should be one shoulder width to one shoulder width and a half apart. Okay? And if we were to draw a line from each heel to toe on the same foot and continue that line forwards, this line should not cross for about a meter in front of your body. Okay? So with hands put your sides. Okay? So shoulders are back and relaxed. And knees bent. Okay? Now relax. Okay. So now with the side on view, I'm in this view here. You see my knees are not forward of my toes. Okay, because if my knees get forward of my toes, this creates pressure on the knee, causing damage to the patella and surrounding tissues. Okay, my spine should be straight. Uh, as you can see, a lot of people have curvature here, because this is a natural thing. Now, for Wing Chun, we want to straighten this out so we can transfer energy better, okay, from the ground up and, and back. So what we have to do here, which is to tilt the hip. And by tilting the hip, if, you, if I pull my t-shirt forward, you can see the arch. If I tilt my hip, you can see that straighten, okay? Do you see? So I tilt this way. So this bit's going back, this is going forward. It's like I'm on, um, on a skewer. So I tilt the hip, this straightens the spine. What a lot of people you'll see do online is they'll push the hip forwards like this. And what this does is it sits the weight of the person backwards. So now all, coming, all incoming force cannot be transferred to the ground and back up. Instead, incoming force will knock you off balance. Okay? So, back to this again. Okay, so, Yiji Kimong now. My hands are parallel to the floor. See the arm? From knuckle to elbow, flat the floor, spine is straight, shoulders are back and relax. Knees are behind the toes, a weight is evenly distributed between both feet. Okay, heels are shoulder width to shoulder width and a half apart, head is up, and spine is in line. Okay. Uh, please show your support and subscribe to my channel and click on the bell icon below so you can continue to keep up to date with my latest videos. Uh, if you have any questions, feel free to ask in the comments. I look forward to talking to you and doing more videos in the future.